And okay, go. In the top left part of the map, we have our Protoss player. In the pink, it is Dejay's Cobra Muffin. And in the bottom right hand corner, we have our green Protoss player. It is Swanky's Kesora. No. And already a little bit of a just friendly banter back and forth. <laughs> <laughs> Well, this is this is how pretty much it always starts. Though I have the wait, is that BL? Okay, wait, <laughs> bad my luck. Flipping out, going, is that like a lol where he smashed the L into the L? And I'm like, no, that's a B, dummy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so nothing too unusual so, so far. Is just... no. I mean, pretty much the only thing we have to watch for right now is a probe leaving the base. Right. So you're probe leaving right away. It might be a Yannan rush. Right. Could be a proxy. If it's not. You don't see that happen right away. Then we pretty much wait until they get past Cyber Core Tech. Yeah, yeah. Because I don't, I don't expect to see anything aggressive from right now at this point. No, no. I wouldn't expect to see anything aggressive from either one of them. Nope. Okay, so let's see here. What was the last really big? Oh yeah, I guess the last really big tournament ended with one on the PvP series, didn't it? Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Uh, CJ Hero versus Rain. And Jay Dong almost made it into the finals. Was yes, like, that was so. so oh, that was terrible. That was hard to watch. Yeah, to like two two and everything, and just, it, uh, it was it was hero. So like, I'm not too disappointed in that. Heroes, no, that guy is hero's good. Beast. So, Case is sending out a probe. I don't know if it's for if he's strictly for scouting or if he has something up his sleeves. Yeah, you have the option of doing this in this matchup. There, are kind of, there's always been kind of an argument about it. I've noticed with Protoss players, a lot of them will be like, "Why should I send the probe over? I'm not going to see anything I haven't seen before." Other people like they just want to see what they're doing with their Chrono Boost, for example, or how much gas they're picking up. You can learn a little bit from that, but usually it's more you can eliminate that something is not happening. You send right. this guy up here, you know he is in fast expanding, will be like in a really aggressive way. Um, you know that, like, if you see him with a mostly full Chrono Boost bar, you probably should be pretty concerned. Yeah. Uh, like, more gate tech, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> this conversation. But pretty much as far, that's pretty much as far as it gets. <laughs> Goodness. <laughs> Otherwise, so a lot of players will actually just hold back with the, the probe until a little bit later in the game, or okay. scout with uh, just their army later. Oh, Case. Case being an absolute baller, however, and doing one of the most rare builds in Protoss Arsenal. Proxy Nexus Cannon. Yeah. But uh, I don't think it's going to do anything. <laughs> well, he's doing it in his face, so this is a little bit... Um... It's more just him being a little BM. Yeah. <laughs> a little cheeky. There say. are Technically, there is one other thing you can do with this, and that's build a couple army units and warp them into his base. Oh. That is... The problem with that, though, is if he sees it coming, is... Um... Yeah, but I think Case is just doing it to make it look like he's goofing around, but... Oh, okay, so he... Probably just, he's just trying to get the to get pylon spotted. up, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Cancel the Nexus. Well, it's like a 200 not. mineral pylon. Not bad, though. Yeah. So... He's sending his Mothership core down as well. The probe is still alive, so that's actually kind of big. And hmm. okay, so Covert has a Stargate down now, which is going to be a bit of a pain. Oh, he's not going to get oh, that. He's got it up. He's got the. He doesn't have quite. Does he have the energy? Nope. He will in a second or two. Can't take any more damage yeah. if he actually wants to get to no. the Nexus, though. Oh, oh he, he gets it. He gets it though. Photon overcharge goes down, he's going to be able to probably yeah. get gold. This is awkward. This is really weird. <laughs> uh, photon I don't overcharge even... versus photon overcharge. Yeah. I mean, Case is target. Looks like he's target firing that pylon. Try and depower a couple of those, uh, those two gateways that are coming up. Yeah, I think it creates the possibility of that. Maybe that last one actually will get cut out. Yeah, it yeah, does. That last, yeah. All right. I don't, ooh, we built another bunch of core. Ooh, that's uh, cheeky. <laughs> he's tiger is... firing the gateway. Yeah, Case. he's going from here into uh, warp gate tech. Yeah, wow. I got on the field. That is low ground. That is really. Ah, uh, 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 
So one Void Ray is pretty good against a couple Stalkers. Yeah, I see yeah. that. He that does is get a... one of the Stalkers. <clears throat> Mothership Core is just barely... Oh, okay, no, there it goes. Case loses his uh, Proxy Nexus. Yes, though he has so many minerals, he's probably okay for now. Yeah. But yeah, it does put him a little bit behind. I think if uh, Covert builds up his army just a little bit, he's going to have a pretty yeah. difficult to deal with lead here. And he does have another Void Ray coming in. And he's got, what, three Stalkers and a Zealot? Mm -hmm. Personally, whenever I'm running a build with Stargate like this, I feel in a lot of cases you just need to get up to about three Void Rays and you can collapse whatever defenses they have. Yeah. Case is going, he's going for the long gamble. Well, I like to put it this way because, I mean, let's face it, that's a type of uh, all in ish sort of thing. And you need to respond by doing something that's super risky. And the risk yeah. here he's taking is, I bet he's not going to deal with me for a while. Not to mention I have a ton of extra minerals. Yeah, but... So, this army goes. is pretty imposing, and like it could. Yeah, I the, think it'll the help of that that void ray. If he has the the two void rays, if they have the charge, then he can clean up those stalkers super fast because of that the extra damage to armored units. Indeed. So yeah, this forces him to back off for a little while, but uh, it won't be too much longer. Yeah. A phoenix. Interesting. Hmm. There's no overlord, so I don't. Well. He, oh, can, he can lift, he can he remove can lift one or two units from the yeah. fight this way, so it does have its purpose. Yeah, see right there, like if you're just saying. But it's interesting to transition from that instead of just sticking with the void race. Oh no, he's cornered him in the back oh, of the base. Yeah, this is a really bad engagement for Case. He doesn't have anything to fight off those void rays, especially combined with the, the DPS from the stalkers. Um, yeah, no nothing left for Case here, and two Phoenix, two void rays, and what five? Six stalkers plus three more coming up the ramp. Case only has the three. He's gonna try and pull. It's well, look like he's gonna try and pull probes. Yeah, I don't think. Oh yeah, there's boy. Nothing he can. Case Whatever can really his do. plan is. It's running out. There it goes. Pulls the entire yeah. army and the uh, entire worker line as well. Oh, uh, but you can see it's. Uh, two of the stalkers get lifted. There's no DPS coming from them. Yeah, and now he's. Yeah. With that, cool. he's actually just gonna win the air battle, and that's gonna. Yeah. Uh, put the nail in the coffin. All right, GG.